Uh, hi, this is Jason. i got a little project I decided to work on. Uh, I was considering buying uh, one of the SATEC radio modules uh, for my flight simulator. They're about 150 bucks, and uh, they match this equipment here. And uh, I was thinking about doing that, but then I said, started thinking to myself, well, wait a minute, I, I could actually build one of these myself. So that's kind of what I'm doing here. Uh, here you see uh, X-Plane 10. Um, what I've got is um, I'm exporting uh, the COM and NAV radio data. That's the stuff that shows up here and here and here. Uh, I'm exporting that over the network uh, using the X-Plane 10's UDP protocol. Uh, I've got a c .net program written here. Uh, it's currently reading in uh, the COM and NAV frequencies for both radios. And then um, I've got an Arduino here hooked up to an I2C LCD display. And um, I'm using my program here to uh, read the data from x 10 and then take that data and push it to the serial COM port at 9600 baud. That's what the Arduino is picking up and then the Arduino is displaying the data on the display here. So if I go over here and I click on the screen and uh, adjust the frequency oh I don't know, let's see, let's go up to uh, 121 you can see on here that it's actually changing as I click um, as I adjust the frequencies you see that on the display so uh, the only thing that I have left to do is um, I need to add a couple of knobs and, uh, and a, a standby switch knob uh, basically the stuff that you see here I'll just have to uh, put in some rotary encoders and, uh, and I'll be done.